If you stand on this bridge on Dust Bowl and shoot a Sticky Bomb, Bobble, Milk, Jurati, or Cleaver, it just bounces off. The funny part is you can actually hit enemies with these reflected projectiles. And to top it off, it sounds like concrete when you walk over it instead of wood. Now this wouldn't be that odd if it weren't for the fact that there's the exact same bridge right around the corner that doesn't have any of these properties. So what's the difference between these two bridges? Over in Hammer, we can see that the first bridge is a funk brush, whereas the second is a funk detail. In TF2, funk brushes have this unusual property where some physics objects bounce off instead of interacting normally, and for some reason, they also turn all of the footstep sounds into concrete. So this begs the question, why didn't Valve make both bridges funk details? There's no way to know for sure, but it could have been to reduce the amount of T-junctions, which I don't have time to explain, but can completely blow up a map. 